Hi everybody, welcome to a new Python tutorial. This time I implement a fun little script that can automatically download images from Google. This can be very useful if you are a machine learning engineer and need training images, but it's also useful for various other things. So let's start. And here I already copied two things in here. The first one is the Google URL when we search for images. And the second one is a so-called user agent header, which we later pass to our get request. So don't get confused by this. You can just copy this too. This basically tells the website what operating system you have, what browser version and some more information. So the Google site needs this information so that it can work properly. So let's continue and let's import the modules that we need first. So we say import OS for operating system. Then we import JSON because later we work with JSON data. Then we also import requests. So this is an awesome third party module to send get requests. And if you haven't installed this already, then you can do this with saying pip install requests. And we also say from BS4 import beautiful soup. This is another great third party library uh, to parse HTML. And we also have to install this with saying pip install BS4. And now we can go on. So first I say if name equals equals main. So I will only want to run this as my if this is my main script. So now I say call this main function and this I will create it here. So define main. And now the first thing I want to do is to create a folder in which I save my images. So I will create this as a global variable save folder equals and I will call this images. And then first I want to check if this already exists. So I can say if not os dot path dot exists save folder. If this does not exist, then I want to create this and I can do this by saying os dot make dir save folder. And this will create the folder inside the current folder from which I'm running the script. And now I have my folder. So now I can say download images. So this is another function that I create here. So define download images. And now the first thing I want to do is to ask the user for some input. So I want to ask what he is looking for and how many images he wants. So I say data equals input. And here I say, what are you looking for? And then I also say number of images equals the next input. And here I ask how many images do you want? And I will uh, convert this to an integer. So I'm assuming that this is a number and I'm not doing any safety checks here. So you can do this for yourself. Um, and now let's print start searching. And first of all, let's get the final URL. So let's say search URL equals. This is our Google image URL plus Q equals. So this is because this is a query. And then we put in the data. And now let's print the search URL. And let's run this first to see if this is working. So from our terminal, we say um, Python main dot pi. And then it's asking me what are you looking for? So let's say a cat and how many images let's just say one for now. And then it's giving me this uh, URL. So now if I open this, then it will open the browser. And here I have the Google search site and it looked or it searched for cats. So this is correct. And now let's have a look at the actual 
raw HTML of this website because now what we need, we need to extract the actual image links from all this text. And I can tell you that this is hidden inside all the diffs with a class that is called archie underscore meta. So here inside this, we have the actual links that we want here. Um, so now let's continue and crawl this website to extract these H uh, this links. So let's say for this, we first send a get request to this website and say response equals requests dot get. So here we use the requests module. And here we put in the search URL URL and also the headers argument headers equals. So this is the user agent because without this, it won't return any re results. And then to get the actual text, we say HTML equals response dot text. And now let's uh, crawl this HTML and only extract the diffs with the arch archie meta class. So for this, we create the soup, the beautiful soup by saying soup equals beautiful soup. And this will get the HTML and then it will also need to have a parser. And here I will put in the default parser, which is um, which is HTML dot parser. And now I can say results equals soup dot find all. I want to find all diffs. So diff and where the class is Archimeta. So I will put this as second argument as a dictionary and the key is called class and the value is called RG underscore meta. So this will extract all the diffs with this class name. And now let's extract the actual image links. So image links equals this is an empty list first. And now let's loop over our results for result in results. Um, and first of all, let's get the text of this result. So it's text equals result dot text. And for now, just print this to see how this looks like. Now let's save this and let's clear our terminal and run this again. So I'm looking for a cat and I want one image. And now it didn't work. Sometimes it's not working. So let's try this again. And how many images did I say? Oh, so it put all the images. So I forgot. I want to put a limit for my um, beautiful soup. Um, so here in the find all I can say limit equals number of images. So only that many results I want to have. And now let's clear our terminal and run this again. So I'm looking for a cat and only one. And now it's working. And here we can see how this text looks like. So this so the first one is still our our string of the URL and this is the whole text. And now if you can see this correctly, um, then you might notice that this is a valid JSON string. So this is in, in a JSON format. So we can convert this string to a actual Python dictionary. Um, by saying, let's say text dict equals JSON dot load s. So from a string and here I put in the text. So this will deserialize the JSON to a Python dict. 
And now I have a dictionary. And now if I have a look at this down here, then the actual link here is in a has the key O U. So I want to extract this key. So now I say link equals text dict uh, with the key OU. And then I will put this into my image link list image links dot append link. For example, I can also extract the type of the image with the itty um, key. So in this case, it's a P and G. But I will not do this now. So you can also do this for yourselves if you like. And now I extracted all the images. So or the actual links and now I continue. So now I say print. First of all, let's print how many images we found found. And here I say lang image links um, found that many images. And now we can start downloading. So print start downloading. And now we loop over the actual links and send a get request again. So for I and image link in enumerate image links. So the enumerate function will give me the current index and the current value. And now I will send a request by saying response equals requests dot get this image link. And now let's download this image. Let's create a name for this by saying image name equals and this should be in the save folder. So in the images folder. So this must be included in the name plus and then it will get a slash and then the actual name for this. So I call this data. So in this example cat plus and then let's give this the number and convert this to a string i plus one plus and let's simply say save this as JPEG since I didn't extract the actual type. Um, but this will work fine. And now let's open this and say with open image name. And we want to open this in read and binary mode as file. And then I can simply say file dot write and here I write uh, response dot content. So this is the actual binary content of this image. And that's all I have to do. And now we are done. So let's print done. And let's save this and run this and see if this is working. And for this, first of all, let's um, see the explorer here. So let's um, delete the images folder first. So move to trash. And now let's run this here. So Python main.py. What are you looking for? Cat. And let's say I want five images. And it found five images. It's downloading. And here I have my images folder. And cat one. And yeah, it's a cat. Cat two. Cat three. So yeah, it's working fine. And that's pretty much it. I hope you liked it. Uh, if you like it, please subscribe to the channel and see you next time. Bye.